is not the myth, but a real fact. The certain foods will alleviate your mood and certain foods make you so gloomy. So what is the effect of food and your mood? That is what we are going to discuss in this video. And how what you eat directly affects your brain is also very important for us to know. Do your brain a favor and reach for a handful of mood boosting foods. Think about nuts instead of donuts. So here is how I'm going to explain it to you regarding how to improve your mood with the food. So people often turn to comfort foods like chocolates and ice creams when they are feeling pretty down. But too much of those foods can make the things worse and also sometimes make you gloomy. So what is the flip side of the story? Many essential nutrients and foods can actually boost mood in the long run. These are the foods which includes vitamins such as A, B, C, D and E. And also the important minerals such as chromium, iron, zinc, selenium, magnesium and also antioxidants and omega-3 fatty acids. All of these have a different roles in supporting a healthy brain. You have to remember that the nutrients, especially vitamins, are needed for every single chemical reaction which takes place in the brain as well as in your body. So, what exactly is the brain food? How do these nutrients boost your mood? Let's talk about one by one in detail. Chromium. So chromium is rich in broccoli and also in apples and whole grains. So this chromium can help to increase the levels of the neurotransmitters, mainly serotonin, which is a mood elevator, right? Not only it elevates the levels of the neurotransmitter like serotonin, it also increases the levels of norepinephrine and tryptophan. These are the important neurotransmitters which all help to regulate emotion and the mood. This is the function of the chromium which is present in the broccoli. Another one is the magnesium. Magnesium is more often found in leafy greens, nuts, legumes, it's one of the most important minerals in the body. So insufficient levels can lead to many problems including headaches, insomnia and agitation. Because magnesium may also have an antidepressant effect. So there's a reason if you have lack of magnesium, you may go into the depressive mood also. You may not feel so active. And this magnesium is also very very important to maintain the rate limiting steps of the major metabolic enzymes in our body. So maximum metabolic reactions and those enzymes require magnesium as a cofactor. So also to maintain the normal metabolic rate and to maintain the normal metabolism like glycolysis and other metabolic cycles in our body, we need magnesium. Next one is the zinc. Zinc is another highly essential mineral which is found in red meat and poultry and also in oysters, nuts and legumes. So this zinc acts as a cofactor for hundreds of coenzymes in the body. It is also important for the normal hormonal functions to increase the immunity and also immunity of the brain and including the neural function that may help ward off the depression. This is the important function of the zinc. And what about omega-3 fatty acids? So omega-3 fatty acids mainly obtained from the oily fish like salmon and tuna and edible algae. And these have many roles in the brain including lowering the inflammation. Because chronic inflammation linked to diets high in processed foods can lead to depression heart diseases and many other conditions. So that's the reason we often say that don't use the processed foods most often. And what about vitamin B6? Not only the vitamin B6 
Even B9 and B12 are found in foods such as eggs, dairy products, citrus foods, and dark green veggies and whole grains. So these vitamins help to regulate the body's homocysteine levels. So what is the homocysteine and what is the function? Homocysteine is an important amino acid found in small amounts in the body. But when these levels increases, you may have a higher risk of heart disease and depression. So keep your B12 and folate levels high to prevent these conditions. And what is the role of vitamin A, C and E? All the three are antioxidants and are hundreds of polyphenols found in the plant foods, including fruits, vegetables, legumes, green tea, herbs and spices. So these are the foods which mainly repair the oxidative damage in the body as well as in the brain, which may offer some protection against depression, dementia and many more important functions in the brain. And exploring the food and mood connection, that is what we have to concentrate here. So we now have very extensive and consistent evidence around the globe across the lifespan that healthier diets are associated with approximately 30% reduction in the risk of depression. The latest clinical trials such as MILES at the Food and Mood Center recently confirmed that the healthy diet can help alleviate the depressive symptoms. So the mood boosting foods that help the people to feel happier and found in traditional Mediterranean diets. So a lot of plant foods including fruits, vegetables, legumes, nuts, seeds, olive oil, along with the moderate intake of fish and dairy. This is a proper Mediterranean diet. And the idea of whole foods being consumed as opposed to a single nutrient is being examined by the researchers because whole foods have a multiple beneficial effects on the brain as well as on the body health. For example, the fiber found alongside of the vitamins in the fruits and vegetables feeds healthy gut bacteria which in turn lowers the inflammation may be associated with the lower risk of depression. So the way nutrients and other food components interact in our bodies is exceptionally complex mechanism. So focusing on one at a time is not particularly useful. So you have to consume together in the food. So many single nutrients have been studied for the treatment for depression. What these studies reveal are typically small effects. This is probably because of the brain does not need just one nutrient. It needs a broad array of nutrients, especially to optimize the brain health. And also it is equally important to avoid junk and processed foods that directly harm the brain and the gut. So anything that benefits the gut is likely to benefit our physical, mental and the brain's health. This is a take home story from this video. So next time when you reach for the donut, consider replacing it with an apple to bring a smile on your face a handful of nuts for the better night's sleep or make yourself a green tea to help ward off depression. Stay healthy, stay safe and stay focused and improve the concentration by alleviating your mood by taking such kind of rich foods with rich nutrients. Thank you.